Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Push Start. My name is Andy Lee and I'll be taking you through the tips and tools that will help you get started on a productivity journey. Now, this is a different type of episode because I'll be sharing a tool instead of the tips and tricks that I've been sharing with you guys. And I'm talking about a low budget, minimalistic, simple, but very effective tool right here. And I'm talking about a watch. More specifically, the Casio F91W watch. Now, I've been using this watch for about, say maybe five months or so, nearing to six months, and I must say I've been loving it. Now, it stands out as a very low budget um, watch. You can get it for about 450 up, 450 rands going up. I know on Amazon you can get it on like uh, special for like $17 but the problem is if you're living in Africa or in South Africa more specific the shipping costs my god you could buy a second watch with that shipping cost alone right so for me to have it internationally shipped through Amazon doesn't make sense so I went with the local is like a route will take a lot not a sponsor but you can find this at any reputable watch shop and i need to be careful with this one because there are a lot of counterfeits that go on since it's a very um ubiquitous and very simple watch that everyone likes using so this one that i have here this variation is the gray and black now i saw this from uh, uh one of my favorite lecturers mr spambo and he was rocking it in class and he made a comment about it and i started seeing it when i like consulted him and stuff like that i was like oh that's a cool watch then i started seeing it with other friends as well now they had uh, f91 w's and then they also had a 50 uh, 158 so that's the silver type of watch and i thought these are very classy and they're very simple and you can dress them up and you can dress them down so you can in a formal setting and you can also use this in a workplace now i will go on olympia and say this is the best budget watch for students whether it's high school um varsity and also young professionals in the stem industry so your science tech engineering and mathematics the reason why i say this is because of its low profile as you can see in the b-roll it's low profile you can literally do anything with this watch and this one that i have here does have scuffs and stuff like that but i believe that gives it character because you know it shows that i'm actually working and i'm using it but i think if you're someone that would like to preserve the quality of the watch then use the the all black version which is much 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 better in terms of absorbing the scuffs and things like that and a feature that i've been using for quite a while right now and i'm surprised that it actually works this well is the alarm so in the morning when i wake up i use my phone as the backup because i'm trying to wean off my phone and depending on my phone for everything so i started using the watch i set my alarm in the morning i'm a bit of a light sleeper so i'm able to hear the, the watch and then when the time my phone goes off I'm already up the watch is on my table then I put it on there we go and then a second feature that I like about the watch is the hourly notification so you set it on on one of the toggles there and then it gives you a bleep every hour now I know that I'm someone that can lose track of time especially if I'm engaged in a task so in order to keep productive and in order to keep punctual or at least I like to think I'm sure my girlfriend would have a debate about that is the hourly notifier it enables me to keep track of time because if i know that it was 7 p.m the last time i checked the time then a beeper goes off then i know oh the hour has gone past so it's a daily reminder to keep me on my toes when it comes to time then also another feature that i like which you can access by the toggle is the stopwatch feature and I'm, I'm loving this because sometimes i go on walks and i go on jogs right um not often jogs but walks so i then time myself to say okay it takes me about so much of time to go from this place to that other place so that i know how to plan my day in between now i don't have cars yet so this is very useful because the place where i stay taxis sham dololo so uh, it's really helpful when i go out and run errands and then also as well it has the calendar so you can check the date and you can also check the day of the month and it sets it up automatically so you're always on track now this i would recommend to anyone that is looking for a watch and the thing i like about it most is that it's waterproof so i've gone on different types of outings with family and i've been you know at the braai you know um working with food renting my hands 
swimming with the children and, and everyone in the family and it has been able to to take the shock but i wouldn't recommend that you you become like submerged with the watch because at the back it says water resistance up to about uh, i think 50 meters or so so it's a very good watch to have if you are that person that always is at the braai always at the kitchen always at the pool so this is definitely the one for you all right thanks guys for so much for watching this uh episode now if you like this type of episode where i review the, the the tech tools that i've been using please drop a comment down below and if you have noticed there's also a new setup that i have still a work in progress but if you want me to do a video on that and you want to find out which tools i use for my work from home setup please do let me know in the comment section below otherwise smash the like button for the algorithm and subscribe and share with a friend if you think they'd find it useful all right thank you shop